nutrition consultant and clinical herbalist with Eat in Peace Wellness Consulting located in Austin, Texas. And today's topic is lemon juice cleanses. Now the main one that I know of, the most traditional one that I know of, is called the Master Cleanse put together by Stanley Burroughs. And that would be the book that I would recommend reading as getting all the details. But basically what the, the cleanse involves is a 10-day process of drinking a particular beverage along with a vegetable broth. So the beverage that's um, mostly consumed is composed of water, lemon juice, maple syrup, and cayenne pepper. Now, this is a 10-day process, so that's a pretty lengthy period of time to do this. So in terms of different lemon juice cleanses, I would recommend that you could do that cleanse in any particular length of time that you want. Maybe you do it one day a week, you know, Sunday's a day of rest, pick a day. Maybe you do it two days a month. Maybe you do it seasonally. Who knows? But I would definitely recommend, you know, thinking out of the box and not locking yourself into just a 10-day process. So what's in this particular beverage? The other option would be to just make the beverage a daily part of your, of your living. This particular beverage, once again, the warm water, the lemon juice is going to facilitate good digestion and cleansing of the system. The maple syrup is going to provide caloric intake and energy. And the cayenne pepper is going to involve good circulation and dilating the blood vessels so that cells can be fed and waste products can be removed. So that is a fantastic health-promoting beverage that you can make a part of your life. The other um, lemon cleanse that I'm familiar with is just the idea of adding plain lemon water into your diet. So juicing one lemon, adding it to however much water, and drinking that first thing in the morning can be a daily practice that the liver and gallbladder will love upon waking. All night long the liver's been making bile and the gallbladder stores it and that sour taste gets those digest digestive juices flowing in a way that honors the circadian rhythm of the, or the movement